down there. What is up everyone? It's Chris here, CJ Gaming. Playing some Ark Survival Evolved on the Aberration map. I uh, just like to say thanks to everyone that was watching my previous videos. Um, I'd actually uh, streamed through Twitch um, and then uploaded to YouTube, so the video quality wasn't great. Um, I've now got a um, other media LGP Light capture card, so um, hopefully everything will be a lot better now. And Um, just to run through, it's the same stats as before, but for any new viewers, um, taming speed is as high as possible. Uh, experience is two times, gatherings two times. Um, I've slightly um, elongated the days and shortened the nights. Um, but apart from that, everything is quite standard. Um, oh, and one final thing is when leveling weight, um, it increases by quite a bit. Just so weight's less of an issue in the game. Um, okay, so let's get going. I have spawned by the uh, Fertile River, which is a medium area. Um, I did spawn here previously, and it is a really good area. If you follow the river all the way along, you get to a water. Um, and there's metal there. Um, there's an entrance into the lower blue area. Um, and it seems like a really good place to be, so I've probably... We'll head over there eventually. It is quite dangerous. There's carcanades and spinos all along the river, so it's quite hard to get there. But for now we're just going to start gathering, just leveling up, getting on our way to being able to get somewhere safely and tame some dinos. But I haven't really played much Aberration, really. I did um, a couple of videos before, like I said, through Twitch. Um, got to sort of around getting black armor and just getting metal bits. Uh, so I haven't really progressed too far. So. Certainly haven't um, explored very far apart from close to the river. So I'm hoping, um, well, I'll certainly learn some things, but you guys watching will hopefully learn some things too. And we'll put that into the last lot. There are our, um, on our operation there is, uh, it's all dark and it's in a cave, so um, there are creatures on here that provide light, and that's why I put that mushroom in the last slot because it uses those for taming. So when we come across them, I'll get one quickly. Stone, however, is a bit of an issue. I am walking around constantly pressing Y and my next box. Oh, there we go. Well, it was not that easy the last time I played. Anyway, let's craft some things. Level up. L. Definitely weight. See, weight goes up 60 at a time, so um, weight should be a less of an issue on this playthrough and a bit more bearable. Water skins are really helpful on here as well, but as I'm quite close to the water and I won't be going too far away from it, I can um, hold out for the moment. Need to catch it. Okay. So I believe you follow the flow of the river for this way. So you can see already Carcanos and Sarko over there. It's not the nicest place to be. Also, these these little boulders, which are really smooth and round, um, they're good source of low amounts. Some spears, right, we need some wood. A few more spears because they do break far too often. I'd be really interested to see how you guys find aberration at the moment. I've um 
bit of a change for me. You have played a lot of um, island and center um, squads, and it's all outside, it's all mainly flyer based. Um, so this will be a bit of a change for me because I do like flyers. Um, I don't really have them in here. Later, and then there are dodos around here, so I might kill a couple of dodos with the hide. Unless they vanish now, which they seem to have. Ah, there we go. doing everything possible but I, I do like building and I do like um, freedom for fun so doing stuff and that sort of thing I'll uh, well, let me know and I'll, I'll put videos up of my builds as well as the playthrough probably do them separately as separate videos just for those people that prefer to watch a playthrough and not that interested in building I'll, I'll do them separately Well, we can get along here without dying. Now guys, when it comes to spawning in, um, if you've not played this map before, and you see a spawn location, one called the Portal, which is down as the easiest spawn place, I would be very, very wary of it, because, it's, <laughs> in my opinion, it is not the easiest place to spawn. Um, it's surrounded by raptors, there's not any water, and the only way to water is to go for a lot of hard, high level monsters. Um, so I just always go to the river. Really. The lake's a good option, but I really like this place along the river. I'll show you as we get further along. It's just up there. I'll head inland a bit to avoid some of these. I know, see, it's already encumbered. Got some more in weight. Function base until I get sort of to the stone um, building materials. Uh, at the beginning of games, I tend to just use um, a few thatch foundations and put everything on there, so it's nothing, nothing pretty at all. Um, but it's functional to begin with. going near it, they're everywhere. Um, yeah, so we'll let him be. Also, be wary. Be wary of red mushrooms. We will come across them, they're hardly few. <clears throat> also guys, be wary of red mushrooms. <laughs> Um, they're not rare, they're around, um, so I'm just watching up there earlier. Right, we'll leave this guy, those ravagers are being a massive pain. Oh, talking about red mushrooms, there they are. You walk into them, you get sort of a uh, hallucin hallucinogenic quality, I guess you could call it. Um, you can't see, you end up getting really dehydrated, can't breathe, and in typical arc fashion you poop everywhere. So um, avoid if you can. If you're on a diner you can walk over them, but if you walk in yourself, just, just be careful. Okay, so we've 
getting there slowly. Some green gems there. <clears throat> and actually down that way, I'll, I'll show you later on, but towards that blue area, not too far. Uh, there's blue gems as well, so um, there's quite a good sort of selection of resources around here. Oh no, oh no, raptors. Um, that really coming after me. No. Yeah, so this is a really good area. Um, that dangerous area, but it is really good. Uh, Spino. And the scorpion. Towards the end of the river, where I'm actually going to set up a like, mini base. It's a little less dangerous. The only problem is it's quite loud. Um, with the waterfall, so I might try and build slightly away from it this time. I'm here up already. The waterfall is just just up there. But I'll, oh, I'll try and cross the river, and get across the other side. There's a cool looking spino. Again, all these shock this this mantas, piranhas, you go. Um, so I may not be feasible to get across the river just yet. Climb up here. Oh. Should I just go for it? No. Okay, so I'm thinking setting up over here maybe. It's a cool little area and you've got a nice view. And very for a long period, I think I'm going to go metal, metal veins here. Yeah? So you can see blue veins going through the rock. There's a lot of metal in there. And they actually go through the rock here. One there, one in there, one there. So there is a lot of metal. There we go. Try 
I can already feel it, this, this paper is going to be good. Come on Jasper, show everyone. You look like, don't be shy. Come on. Stop. Oh. Awesome. There he is. Look at him. So fancy. So fancy stuff, I you know it. Flipping into structures is um, into environment is off on this paper as you can see. And the foundation the walls are really helpful. Building mechanics can be a bit of a pain. Hard usually. But I think we look at A there. Even back. Give the glasses to Jasper. really helps to begin with, or certainly for me, um, is some sort of pain that will get you marker berries, because I go through so many marker things, gathering the berries on my own. Too much for me, so um, I usually go and get a trike or a stego. Um, and 
Feed him on any guard. Currently a single. Bit slow going, especially because they run. But I will give it a go on this playthrough right now, just so we have something else to see. Now we have our Jasper. Okay, so we've got some try. Try and fine. And 15. Right, let's give this a go then. Let me go up there. Actually, will they be able to run up here? Maybe. Thank you.